Good morning everybody, it is day 9 of our Take Charge Tour. Uh, yesterday was a great day at TPI. Um, today we are on the way to see a guy called Robert Yang, who is a nutritionist and uh, strength and conditioning coach. Um, so we've got an appointment with him at 11 o'clock and we're going to video, uh, we're going to talk about nutrition on the golf course. So um, for anyone who's interested in health and fitness and performance and how, it, how that impacts it, then uh, Robert Yang knows his yeah. stuff. He really does know his yeah. stuff. So, um, and a lot, a lot of people neglect the nutrition, um, maybe for a few reasons. Maybe they don't know what to eat. So, hopefully, we can educate you guys on what sort of foods you should be eating before, during, and after you go on the golf course. That's the hard part, isn't it? People yeah. don't, maybe don't know what to do, and, and it's a bit of preparation time. But once you get into that mode, it's, it's and once you see the results, yeah, because you will get results. You'll perform better. You'll feel better. You'll look better. Sounds good. So. We're going to go nearby a golf shop first to get some exploding golf balls for something we've got later on in the week. Um, and then we're heading to Robert Yang, so it should be a fun morning. Yeah. Uh, and then we've got a bit of the afternoon to maybe do a bit of shopping and plan for um, tomorrow when we head to LA. So Another training session, I think. Another training Another session. Fitness Quest Sounds 10, good. here we come. <laughs> this is our 28th Remembers? video, by the way. This is our 28th video we worked there yesterday. So uh, we've produced, obviously, yeah, 27 videos. It's 27 videos. Some more in, videos today as well. In eight days. So we'll hit the 30 mark today in eight days. That's a lot, isn't it? When cars cut you up like he just did, we should have a paintball machine gun in the front which shoots them with paintballs. Is that legal? I'm not sure, Andy. If anyone thinks they can do that and invent that, I'll buy it. Oh, rant over. Okay guys, so we've just arrived here and this is Robert Yang. Robert's going to be doing some videos with us today. And he knows his stuff when it comes to nutrition. And powerlifting as well, so please listen to what he has to say. Uh -huh. uh, so He's extremely gonna... strong and he wants to tell you what to eat today. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, listen to him. <laughs> so we're just going to set up the cameras and then we're going to get cracking with the video for uh, the nutrition. So uh, some interesting stuff for you. Okay, we're just in between takes and uh, Andy's asked uh, Robert about coffee and the uh, effects of it because Andy's a bit of coffee at this yeah, yeah. not really. Yeah, he's got a cup of coffee, but obviously he wants to know what he's doing for him. So. I'll have to tell you later, I think, because I'm not going to be able to end the conversation. Okay, there you have it. So, uh, coffee's good for you. Well, coffee's okay as long as you train hard, but uh, if you don't train hard, don't rely on it to boost your energy. So, uh, that makes sense. Makes sense. Just got the fans on because it's really hot in here. Morning. So I just said to Piers, take note of that sign up there for when he's going through his workouts. So Piers is just micing himself up, getting ready to do some um, power lifting. <laughs> so this should be fun. So I think yeah, Rob is going to take him through um, some simple stuff that he can do in the gym that's sort of uh, that's going to help him with some power. <laughs> Easy pace, right? <laughs> where's the where's the girl section? <laughs> okay, that was interesting, Pierce. Mm, good stuff, good stuff. Talking about nutrition. That just yeah, for him. This wasn't too bad. That just for him. Too bad. So that was good, um, Robert Yang. There, great guy. 
very knowledgeable about his nutrition and even mm-hmm. took Pierce through some basic power movements, which are probably going to have a little go at when you get back home. I think yeah? So, yeah, yeah, absolutely. So, uh, well worth a watch. Make sure you check out the videos. Um, so on some real simple stuff there, you yeah. know, you can just just anyone work. can do that unless you're in in, in some serious pain. You know, so it's, it's, yeah. worth, it's worth looking. Okay, now we're off to maybe do some training again, mm-hmm. and then a bit of planning for tomorrow when we head to LA. So we're here at the Scotty Cameron Gallery, which is a, a new shop, only been open a couple of months. Um, just selling some um, some unique putters, isn't there, Pierce? There, some uh, Scotty Cameron putters and clothing, clothing, and head covers, uh, top end as well, real top end, some very individual collectors' items, putters. Um, unfortunately, we're not allowed to take any footage in there, which is absolutely fair enough. But um, if you if you've got a few grand hanging around and you want a putter, which is a bit different. This is not a bad place to come because yeah. there's some pretty exclusive stuff in there. Ranging from 500 to 9,000, so mm. yeah, some expensive putters there. You must put well with that. Collectors items, I know. Yeah, you wouldn't want to put with it, would you? You feel a bit bad kicking your putter after you missed a three footer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, check out that Range Rover there. That is my dream car. The so Range Rover, if you're watching, that's my dream car. Check it out. Just like that. As well as a Ferrari, of course. You've got to have two, haven't you? Lambo for you. Lambo for me. Bright green. So that was our last visit to Fitness Quest 10. I've just been in there and had a bit of a stretch, that's all. Um, working on some of the things that uh, TPI found out the other day, which I already knew really, but I didn't really do too much about it anyway. Um, but being as we're playing tomorrow, fingers crossed, I thought we'll do a little bit of a mm. movement work and loosen things up. Good idea. Uh, Pierce is struggling, he's not feeling too good today, he's got a bit of a mm. sore throat. Been a bit of a girl today. So uh, we're going to go and cheer him up with an in and out burger. He's never had an in and out burger. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead, head back, in and out burger and then get in the apartment and start planning and uh, getting sorted for LA and then um, hopefully have a free night, our last night in San Diego so um, we may head out for the last night. So. A few tears tonight I think. A few tears. It yeah, could well be, could well be. <laughs> See you later Fitness Quest 10. See you next year. Driving there, Pierce. Oops. English drivers. Right, Pierce. I'm gonna have one. That's mine on the end there. It's a double. You thought you thought you'd be greedy. He'd have two. Uh-oh. These two are both Pierce's. Good luck. Please. I'm sure that's going to make you feel better. Oh, I don't like that raw onion. That's coming off. So we, uh, we've been to Robert Young this morning to talk about good healthy nutrition and we've just been to In-N-Out Burger so um, it doesn't really fit in very well that does it? But it was just sick. It was just to have it. It was just to experience it. Um, but we have been to the gym before for a little bit so it balances out. 